So my first time gambling, we bet $300 on four different sports games to win and we're two for two right now and the other two games look pretty good. One is kind of like back and forth, but so far so good. So we bet 300 and if we win, we win 3,000. And then me and Garrett are actually gonna go to dinner. Where are we going again? What's the place called? Homestead. We're gonna go to Homestead, so it's a steakhouse. And then we're gonna try to go see which show? Uh, absent. Absent. And this is my outfit. This is my sleigh outfit tonight. The Warriors are doing really good right now, so this is actually looking pretty promising. I don't know what I'm gonna buy with all my money that I win. <laughs> Maybe I'll just go gamble with it. We're up by five. Are you excited for your flight? Yes, I am. So, good morning. Or it's actually good afternoon. Solid 120 OBS you threw in there, bud. What are you guys doing? Hey, what are you guys doing? Uh... Yeah. Getting lifted. Getting lifted? Yeah, filling up my tires with air. <laughs> uh, okay, Anzai, what do you think of all this nonsense? <laughs> here, come on. You just go on this side so you have some light, too. Can't believe you lost the cap on this other one. We are filling up air and Gigi's tires. Yeah, you're right. You're only a little bit above 80. You're like 90. You need to be at 120, but it's gonna go down from 120 to 100, just from daily use, probably. But you were a little low. <laughs> when did you buy that? The last time I was there. It's so legit. Yeah, it's worth it. It's so legit. Is that an actual bike pump? Yeah. yeah. Wow. You know, professional over here, you know. Perfect. You good. Yeah. Well, we'll roll around, tell me what you think. <coughs> Go ahead and test it out. Oh, shit. For us. Roll around, tell me what you think, Eric. And you tighten the thing, right? Yeah, I tighten that thing, but I wish you would have a cap. I, I really don't like you not having a cap, because it's just going to get loose so quick. Thanks, Chuck. Appreciate that. Well, what what moron fucking loses a cap to his tires? It's not like I took it off, Chuck, and threw it somewhere. So we are um, leaving on Sunday. Today's Friday. And I have the meet and greet tomorrow. Um, but I think we're gonna go, where are we gonna go? Maybe go to the Cheesecake Factory this morning or this afternoon. It's like one o'clock. We're getting a late start. Come here. Bonsai, me, show them who's give boss. Me that toy. Give me that toy. Ah. God, you fucking strong. No, he's about to get it. No. <laughs> no. Fuck. It's a good pre-workout, Garrett. He's too strong. It's <laughs> me. So you fucking pass out. What are you doing? <laughs> Am I not supposed to do that? No, it's funny. I just. <laughs> I think like break his mouth. Ooh, the ground. Chuck, what are you eating? <laughs> Wait, what are you eating? Let me have a look. Love it. That's really good sick food. <laughs> Chuck is not feeling good, so he got him a tea. But then he got himself some Cheeto puffs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like it. Oh, thank you. Get it 
Don't do it. No, I ain't eating one. Okay, don't do it. This is actually our strip view. I haven't even looked at it. So let's put a little strip. What's up, Bonsai? What's it? Hi. How much should I win though? How much should I win? 2100. Okay, so, and they're half off. So that justifies it. It's essentially free. Exactly. I like it, okay. <laughs> so I wasn't planning on getting anything from here, but the fact that I won a couple thousand dollars and everything's half off, my justification is good. I walked into Christian Louis Vuitton and they were having a sale. And I haven't shopped here in a while just because I've been trying to look way better about spending but sometimes it is okay to treat yourself treat yourself especially if, if it's half off what and because i won like three thousand dollars i lost 900 in gambling so i'm still up 2100 so it completely justifies my shopping because it makes it like it was free right right girls have to justify why we shop okay so these are called socates they're suede um i don't know what Color. This is actually called, it's called Purple Pop. I wanted these actually like six months ago and they're normally like 700, but I got them for like half off. So I love these, yes. So Kate's are like my favorite Christian Louis Vuitton and Lady Peeps are. They're the open toed, um, love, love, love them. And the second ones, yeah. Look at these, aren't they so beautiful? These were also half off, so they were both like 800 together. I know that's a lot, what? but uh, it's my guilty little pleasure, and I bought these because I've been wanting them for a while, and they're on sale. So anyway, I always get super excited when I get to buy myself something nice. And for the second part, Sephora. I know you guys always wanna know what I get from Sephora. So the best, best concealer ever is called Naked and I get the my medium light, medium, medium light, Naked from Urban Decay. Best concealer ever. 
and then I got Anastasia Brow Wiz and I get uh, medium brown. I got Bobbi Brown lipstick, pale pink, and I got a second one. It's called T U L L E. Tole, Tole, I don't know. I suck at grammar and I suck at pronouncing things, so don't judge me. Um, then I got Bobbi Brown Rose lip liner. Chucky, what did you call Christian Louis Vuitton? How do you say it? Christian, what did I say? I thought it was Christian Lomber or something. <laughs> I just saw it walking by and it looked like a fancy store. And I was like, I'm not walking in that place. And I just walked, kept walking. Christian Lomber? Lomber, yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty close. Pretty close. Let's go ahead. Chuck's over here raping my dog. Legitimately raping him. <laughs> nope. Frog yeah. likes this. No, he this makes him get in between his legs all weird like. Every right time he calls Bonsai on the you bed. You see how I'm rubbing him right above the ears in there? Yeah, like that, that tricks him into thinking that you're not going to rape him. He just thinks it's okay. He yeah. Likes it. And then you rape him. <laughs> no. You dog rape this? Dude, he's so content right Sounds now. Sounds like a sick dog he's rape that, you know, Sometimes I even, sometimes I even, <laughs> here, if I'm really lucky, I'll loosen the collar and just go ahead and take her off. <laughs> That sounds so dog raping. <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> See, he even just did the little like the chop. He, like, he hates wearing that collar. He wants to be wild. He wants to be a wild animal.